How's it going guys? Kyle Wilson here. We got another Vivi and Nakomi video. In this one, we'll be talking about the price of Omi. Is there an imminent breakout about to happen? Let's take a look. All right guys, so let's take a look. We're on the charts here and let's go ahead and just zoom in, all right? So currently the price is at 0 .004, or I'm sorry, 0 .00349 on the chart. And what we have here is a pretty crazy pattern, all right? So if you literally look at the chart, you can clearly see that this previous all-time high and this you know, recent high right here hit off the same exact level. I mean, you would have to zoom in and really good to see you know, where the difference was, all right? That is insane, okay? That is literally crazy. Um, and this is what you typically see on a couple and handle pat pattern all right and i know you guys have heard me talk about it before i talk about it a lot because this is the pattern i'm always looking for all right you guys know this okay if you've been watching my video you know this by the way hit the sub and bell notification if you want to be notified of more videos like that i would appreciate it, it helps us break through the algorithm and some, you know what to do if you like the video but anyways back to the chart okay so it's it's green right now okay so the momentum is kind of going back up this is very key all right now this down pattern you know to form a handle it definitely went down pretty hard i usually don't like to i don't like that when i'm looking for a cup and handle pattern i look for maybe you know like a 30 percent decrease or something like that but this one was a significant decrease like over almost 50 percent or more um so I like to see it, you know, a, a handle form a little bit more <laughs> conservatively, but you know, that's the, that, that's just the case that we have with the, uh, the Omi token is it's definitely not a conservative token. It just fluctuates all over the place. Right. But it's still uh, very significant that it's forming a pattern. And as you can see, the bar is starting to turn green and we definitely need to be watching the charts to see what happens next. It's very important. All right, I'm not saying you should buy in right now, uh, you know, because this is not financial advice. But if you see this thing start to trend up, um, I'm definitely going to take a look at it. All right. And I know whales and people watch our videos and watch the videos. So I'm not saying to, you know, buy a bunch of Omi right now, I, you know, seek a financial advisor, do your due diligence. But I personally am going to take a look at this and you see what happens next. All right. So if you don't know what a cup and handle pattern is, let's just go ahead and kind of go over this article, a cup and handle definition, what it is, and let's talk about that. Stock reached a low point, then quickly recovered. The stock eventually ascends smoothly to a point that nearly matches its previous high, then continues to form the handle. Handles usually last less than a month. They handles usually last less than a month, okay? So if we pull this back up, it's literally only been a couple days. So it's like, you know, it's literally, it hasn't even been like a week so or about a week. So it could last a while, right? That's pretty big. They can be in a straight line or descend up to a third of the gain of the cup's right side. A move up usually means the stock's upward trend will resume. Trading volume dries up on the decline, remains low in the base of the cup, and increases as the stock ascends. Strong volume is a clear sign that the upward trend will continue. So there you have it. Like we need to be paying attention to the volume. Okay. I tell you guys this every time I, I, I go on video, I tell you guys to watch the volume. Nobody's out there telling you guys to watch the volume. Look at the volume. Okay. They're just telling you a bunch of prices and look at the char and this, that, and the other and some theories. All right. We're saying, look at the volume. All right. Look at the volume. Look at the volume. Look at the volume. All right. Cause you have to match it up with, you know, what's going on in the chart, the patterns, if you're basing your, you know, trading off of technicals. Okay. Anyways, I'm done. Uh, I'm off my little soapbox there. I want to talk. I just wanted to make sure you guys know uh, what to look for. If you're taking a look at this, you know, I try to teach you guys and tell you guys the best. I'm not a teacher, not a financial advisor, entertainment only. All right, but move along. So uh, let's scroll down to a couple examples. Let's just say, let's just read this. All right. The image below depicts a classic cup and handle formation. Place a stop by order slightly above the handle. So this is just talking about like how to enter the trade. We'll kind of skip that. But as you can see, like what's going on there in this pattern. 
is right there forming a cup handle and then what you're looking for is you know these there's a trend line it breaks through the trend line and then also uh, breaks through that previous high right there that's where you really start to notice a you know a go parabolic okay so there, there's a reason why I look for this pattern all the time is because for that reason all right literally that reason right there uh, because you can make easy gains off of that pattern uh, and it's it's repeated okay some cup and handles are so powerful that they'll just go to the very next level all right talking like you know basically what had happened here this type of uh, action okay it doesn't matter what really people say like look at this look at that pattern right there almost returned to the previous high formed a little handle boom like that that's the type of stuff i'm looking for all right now i'm not saying this one is a specific cup and handle it definitely is forming up kind of like one it definitely went down a lot further than uh than what i like so but that's your typical you know cup and handle pattern and it could look like you know if we go to immutable x you know it's funny that some stuff you know like i said i always tell you guys fundamentally matches up with technical analysis it's kind of weird um and i'm not saying it happens every time but um sometimes there's like a catalyst that just happens that coincides exactly with the technicals um or what it's saying on the chart it's very weird um i've been trading for you know over the years and noticed this every single time like i charted dogecoin earlier this year and i charted amc in the same pattern and it they both broke out like obviously they ended up being like on the news like amc became a meme coin doge like elon musk and this was before that happened like i was charting this and looking for patterns and it's crazy to uh that technicals match up with you know fundamental not even fundamentals but like news or catalysts right so anyways i just wanted to update you guys on that let you guys know what i'm looking at and maybe maybe you guys are looking at it too comment below what are you guys expecting what's the next move what are you guys doing with your omi are you going to hodl it um obviously i am i haven't sold one single omi token um or are you guys going to buy some more what are you guys going to do with your omi tokens let me know in the comments below i'd love to know what you guys are looking at do you think this is a cup and handle pattern answer below but anyways i will see you guys in the next video so peace love vivi and ecomi and also be like an nft be authentic and i'll see you guys in the next one and at the blockchain peace